wa 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 Welcome everybody. Welcome to the Bone Pit. I'm your host Bone Score and today today I have to brush my hair <clears throat> on stream because I forgot to do it beforehand. Oh, I guess also <laughs> we are playing Rugrats Studio Tour. That's right. Uh, a Rugrats Studio Tour is an old PS1 game that I used to rent a couple times back when I was a kid. And I... So I looked up on how long to be... How long to be. Uh, and it's like four hours-ish. So... That's alright, that's not too bad. Uh, we can probably get that done in one day. Um, I never thought that I actually got to the end of it as a kid. I don't, like, remember, like, a sense of, like, feeling like I had completed it. Um, that being said, I do think I went through and I did everything that was available, and four hours total does seem appropriate, I think. Um... We may be able to fly through it faster, depending on how good we are at the video game. Um, but yeah, it's it's rather short. Um, I remember having a blast with it as a kid. Uh, I don't know that I care for Rugrats so much anymore. I used to really be into it as a kid. Um, I think that was one of my favorite cartoons back in the day. Um, but yeah, I just... I don't know, it's just not my thing anymore. Um, but I remember this game being really fun. It had, like, a whole bunch of, like, golf. Like, there there was, like, mini golf and, like, some other sort of mini game in it. I think, <clears throat> as far as I can remember, the studio is divided into different lots, like, where they'd be filming different things, like a pirate movie or a, or a western thing or whatever, right? And, um... Like, there might be, like, a different game in each area. I'm not sure. Um, but we'll figure it out. It'll be fine. We'll have a good time with it. Um, <clears throat> yeah, should be okay. Should be simple enough to get through, I think. So will I just de-hair my brush now? Gotta pull all the fibers out. The hair fibers. Do you, do you refer to them as hair fibers, I guess, like in a technical term? Like if you were to be as technical as possible, are are they are they would you refer to them like as hair fibers or just hairs? Or or would a, a hair be described as like a fiber like whatever? I don't know. <clears throat> I don't know. What I do know is that my hair is brushed out. It's all shaken up now to give it some volume. Looks Way better now. Uh, Firefox is here. Welcome, bud. Welcome, how are you? I hope you're doing well today. I hope you are good. Uh, Firefox asks, You already finished Kirby? I did, man. Kirby took us uh, about four hours-ish. Um, yeah, it was real short. Real short. Uh, there were a couple of like, hidden switches we missed, but they just unlock the same mini-game in, uh, in each zone. Uh, so, yeah, we, uh, we got through it all. We did all the levels and beat all the bosses. King Dedede took us, uh, a couple of tries because he's a dick. He's a bitch. He's harder than the other two that follow him. Um, and I had no problem with them. I think I dealt with both of them. 
I think I dealt with the first guy no problem in one try. And then the second guy, I had started the fight with one health. So <clears throat> one hit and I was down and I had to restart. Um, yeah, like one and two tries respectively. Um, was pretty decent. I love that game. I love Kirby. Um, <laughs> and Sam comes in singing All Star. Hey now, gotta get my game on. And and do you know? Do you guys know that gold glitters, and and molds? You know they they get broken often by the shooting stars. <laughs> Welcome, Sam. <laughs> Welcome. How are you? How are you? I hope you're doing well today. Hope you're doing good. Sorry I butchered your uh, your beautiful singing. <laughs> Just happens sometimes. Um, ready to ready to play some Rugrats. Woo woo! All right. <clears throat> um, I don't know. I have anything to talk about, announce beforehand, I don't know. The final sweep in Terraria is coming along. Things are going well. It's good. I'll be finished in a orderly time, I guess. If you want to call it that, after it's been... I don't know how long. I, I checked out... Uh, how long ago I started um, the other day and um, we uploaded the first video for that January 21st so we've been playing it for well we've been playing it since then or I've been playing it since then building and all of that um, yeah but it's, it's wrapping up it's getting done I'm excited for it. I'm excited to show you guys all my hard work. And be done with it and get back to a normal life. Oh my god. <laughs> oh, Firefox sings the entire next verse of of, of All Star. And then and then Sam also, yep, you guys are going to sing all of All-Star in the chat. Okay. <laughs> all right, my chat is singing All-Star today. That's... <laughs> oh my god, uh, you guys are going to do this, aren't you? You're going to go through like one verse at a time. You know what I can do? I can read the first... What do we say? I'll read the first three words of of each posted verse. Here we go. Hey now, you're it's a cool. Hey now, you're somebody once asked. Well, the years start. Sorry, there was a fourth word on that last one. Hey now, you're. There's a lot of those verses that start like that. And all that. Hey now you're and all that. Sounds like a Baja Men song. Hey girl, you all that. Something, something. He's gonna walk up and, and, and be an idiot on the beach. <laughs> Kids today don't know what a Baja Men is. <clears throat> Kids today don't even know that the dogs were let out, let alone that nobody ever figured out by who. So, you know, let's let's just leave it like that. I have a sneaking suspicion it was the Baja men who let the dogs out, but there is also the possibility that it was their dogs who were let out and they were trying to figure out who. I guess we'll never know since I think they stopped releasing music. 
Farfox says, people still ask who let the dogs out? Oh, okay. I didn't know that was still going around. I felt like that died a while ago, but, huh. Okay, well, that's good to know. It's good to know that the search is still on. And the hunt for that asshole who let those those poor men's dogs out is is continuing. We'll find that bastard. We'll get him one of these days. I can't wait to see, like, some stupid shit post that's just, like, a news fucking uh, report on TV. Like, man who let dogs out finally caught 30 years later. Sentence to to maximum punishment. <laughs> uh, I don't think we got anything to announce today. I can I can mention the Discord, which is there on the Twitch page behind the sub button for you guys to check out. Oh, um. I, sh I should mention, uh, I was checking out, um, my analytics yesterday, um, to see, uh, like, my viewership, how it turned out for my stream and everything, um, I do that from time to time just to see, keep track of how I'm doing, um, and I noticed that, um, it seems like somebody else has, uh, has subbed to the channel, um, there was a, uh, like a third thing in my earnings tab, and, um, I've not, uh, because Twitch doesn't, like, list your, uh, your subscribers anywhere. It lists your followers for you, but it doesn't give you a sub list. Um, I don't know why. Um, but yeah, I don't know who, what, uh, who it was. Um, but whoever out there, um, uh, hit, hit the button there. Thank you very much. Thank you, thank you very much for the ghost subscription. <laughs> um, it's very much appreciated. I, I... I really do. Um, for those of you who don't know, um, if if you are out there listening, um, when you do, um, Twitch will... I think when you, like, come back... You sub, and then you close Twitch, and you come back in, and then it'll offer you um, a prompt to be... Um, like, to type out a message with your subscription and that sets off the alert in my in my stream labs and it makes the little uh emoji thing go off um i don't get the alert that you guys have subbed and there's no indicator that it's happened unless you guys um like type a message with the prompt it offers you and and submit it um which means i can't thank you properly I can't sing your praises on camera as you deserve. So for now, I will just sing praises into the night to, to the kind ghost subscriber. Thank you. <laughs> Whoever it was, I appreciate that. Um, that aside, I, uh, I will get up. I will hit the button and I will do a video game. Bing bomb ba doom bomb ba bomb. I suck at drums. Wah wah wah. Bone score sucks ass at drums. I understand the drum theory like where you're supposed to um like music is just math when it's when it's written out it's basically just math your bar has x amount of beats in it the beats are x amount of length long right etc cetera, etc cetera. um it's just a lot of math and like when it comes to like laying out the specific um because drums aren't like uh <clears throat> it's not like playing uh, like a stringed instrument or uh like any other instrument really uh that i can think of 
most instruments, uh, when you look at the, um, like the sheet music for it, um, bam, sheet music is written out. Um, you've got the staff and then you've got the, um, you got the notes on it that indicate how long the beat is. Oh, that's a little jank on the side. Um, and where it is on the staff determines um, the actual note, like the pitch of it, right? It's like A, A sharp, whatever. Um, but with drums, it's laid out so that... Um, it's, it's laid out so that you have like a symbol or a place for each... Oh, wow. For each of the... Um, the different drums because like the toms will all be tuned to a different no as all the hi-hats the cymbals etc um, the they all have their own everyone. place so oh, it's uh, it's easier to read and it's easier to figure out like down here is where the bass note's going to be all the time right area. and you can just totally cool. get the like the kick drum rhythm etc um, on your right is so it's easy enough to read and write out, but like Bill, getting the coordination, like both hands and both your feet at the same time going like, like different so times and patterns, it it's... Oh. Tried very hard for a while. In your day, they didn't have fighters. you two. This is fascinating. I had the guy that um, that I used to play with. He he was a drummer. Um, had actually been going to um, like extracurricular music school uh, since like kindergarten. Uh, so he was very good, very good at like whatever he played. Um, he was very excellent drummer. Um, I had him try to teach me, and I just do not have the coordination for that kind of crap. I'm a very unbalanced, lopsidey person. I have, um, <clears throat> so most people have arches in their feet, um, like, where the ball is, um, or, no, no, the balls of your feet are at the front, um, around where your ankle is, uh, there's, like, there's an arch in your foot. Um, not in mine. <laughs> My feet are flat for some fucked ass reason, uh, which throws off my sense of balance. So I'm very wobbly and everything like that. So my coordination goes to that and not to this. <laughs> um... The balls of your feet, yeah. Um, everybody with me now. Your hand on your foot. Your big toe. You feel in your big toe. You feel the joint in your big toe where it connects to your foot. That big round part, like at the top of your foot. That's like the balls of your feet. We were taught um, in gym class uh, when I was in elementary school. Um, we were taught like uh, when when you're playing basketball, when you shoot, you like bounce off of no, not your toes, Firefox. The part attached to your toes. It's like you you bounce on the balls of your feet, not like your whole foot. Uh, start game, button select, oh, here we go. All of our settings, so, mm, and there's a Rugrat at each of them. So, multiplayer selection. Mm, this looks... We got controller cool settings. We should see what... To see how it works. Move forward, backwards, left, right, that's cool. Um, start does nothing. Uh, select is exit. Walk is with, wait, squares walk? And X is jump, circle is grab, and triangle is action. 
Wait, okay, so triangle... So grab and action are different. And walk is a button? Walk is a button? We got look right, look left, look up, use power up, and reset camera. Okay. And the... So the left thumbstick is also on the D-pad, the right thumbstick does nothing. Um... Sam said this looks like yoga class. Hey man, it just might be. Uh, we're talking about um, we we're talking earlier about doing like a uh, like a fitness Remember, series uh, of videos, perfect. possibly. Hey guys, Yoga's a part of fitness, really man. Neat. Important part. Stretching is probably like the most important part. Okay, so. Sound settings, vibration function on, music, sound effects. That's it, huh? Okay. Start game. No, dude. You mean like crouch? What? What the walk button? I hope not. Or well, no, I hope it does. But it'd be better if it was walk than, or it'd be better if it was crouch than than if it was walk. Hey, you guys! I think I see a nightlife. Follow me! Uh, but I think I'll just stay here. All alone. In the dark. Okay, so they've wandered oh, off from everybody. It. Here we go again! Into the studio. And now... I have a walkie-talkie! And now the lights have gone out. Sorry, little guys. You can't go into the top secret film. Oh, I remember I this. The only keys to the high tech space age security door, which is open. Oops. Space age security oh, door. Oh, oh, my keys. Double oops. Great. Now I got a what a moron. Keys. Unlock this door and rescue that kid. So much for a long lunch. So, so the young baby has locked himself in the space vault. Uh-huh. How many are there? I didn't, I didn't get a count. Okay, well. So yeah. Here we go. Each one of these is like a different studio with a different uh, thing in it. There will be a grown up and he can open the door himself. Just <laughs> wait long enough for him to grow up. Should fire him. They should. 15 keys, Firefox? Is that for real? If we wait long enough, Two, there will be four, a grown up and six, he can open eight, the door himself. Nine, maybe? I don't know. Okay, diapers of thunder, Captain Cookies, Lazy Saddles, and Outside Space. Uh, I don't know where we want to start. Hollywood! Ain't? Okay. Huh? I'm gonna say, let's start here with the Diapers yeah, of Thunder, whatever that is. I assume it's some sort of racing game. Or, like, a pant shitting simulator. Boy, race car drivers just keep getting younger and younger. The crew's ready to film the big race scenes. So Are you serious, man? And peel out through those doors. Are you fucking for real? You can reach the gas pedals, pedal that is. Can he like maybe just like not see below the rim of the hat? Smell the rubber burning. Okay. So, okay, square does nothing. Oh, okay. So. Moving the thumbstick moves you around. It makes you run. But pressing square makes you walk when you move. That's what it it means when it says walk. Okay, and this is still on a weird old system where... Oh, Jesus. Where the fucking camera is on the triggers. Oh, this is jank. This is really weird. Oh, the camera. I remember this now. Okay, yeah, I remember the camera being really weird. But if your driving skills need a tune-up, make a pit stop at the checkered flag on the ground first, and we'll give. 
You sure you're old enough to drive? Oops. It doesn't no. matter. This is easy. <laughs> the X button is the gas. Press and hold it to go faster. Okay. The square button is the brake. Press it to slow down or stop. Simple. To steer, just press left or right. The R1 button lets you use your special power-ups. Power-ups? Wait, wait, a speech is. bubble and underwear are power-ups. How? I, okay, so I guess we're gonna... How do I... How do I start a drive? I would like to do a drive. Speedway race scene. Press triangle to door. Okay. Let's put the pebble to the metal. Here we go. It's like a stealth movement. Yeah, yeah, you're right, Firefox. <laughs> the camera is drunk. Oh, Reptar! Oh, fuck, you guys remember Reptar? Oh, man! Reptar's so fucking cool! I remember seeing a while ago... Um, fucking Funko did a, uh, did a Reptar Funko, and, like, I'm, like, mostly against Funkos, I don't care for them, um, whoa, but I took a look at that Reptar one, and it was really good, it was really well done, the proportions, the, the coloring, the shapes, everything, what, what does the underwear do, does it get all up? in they face I think what is it, what am I in am I in third no who am I am I Chucky I think I'm Chucky I'm playing as Chucky okay but I came in here as Phil didn't I well at least there's eight laps so like, oh man. Oh, this is really jank for a racing game. You know what's not a jank racing game? The Crash Team Racing um, the remake that came out a couple years ago. That game is pretty fucking solid. So solid, in fact, that I was considering um, making that the replacement game for Yakuza 0 for now, until I decide that I want to play it again. Because I do feel like I need to... like, pick something to play, instead of just like... like, cancelling on Friday every week. Um, and I was thinking about that. We can, we can get through the story mode not too... not too long. It's nice and fun. It reminds me a lot of, um, oh, uh, what's that game? Y you know, you guys know the game. The one I'm thinking about. Uh, Diddy Kong. It reminds me of Diddy Kong Racing. Just like the way the, the levels and everything are, are laid out, the way you, uh, you control your cars, like even the camera angle. I don't know if the same people, like, had any hand in it, or, or what. Oh! So the diaper makes you slippery, I think? Kind of like the oil slick? Yeah. It makes you slippery and you, like, spin out. Alright, so stay away from the diapers. Don't crash into them. There's a lot of thunder in those diapers. Oh no! I almost oil slicked myself into my own beach ball. There's no way I'm gonna catch up to Tommy in time. I'm bare. Yeah, no, Tommy just won. He just won the fucking race. Continue? Yeah, I guess. So, what happens if we collect. All of these reptar things. Like, do they keep respawning? Can I pick up more and more of them? Like, what's the deal there? You I was Third place. Would you like to try again? Yeah. We'll, we'll have to. Um, 
strategy too, luckily. Launch the panties to make your enemies horny. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to this beautiful day. I mean, that's a good debuff. Or a buff, depending on how you take it. But what's that gonna do? What's that gonna do for a race, though? Also, I don't know if that's, uh... What you want in this particular race. Reptar. Okay, so we don't carry over our reptars to the next thing if we if we fail. Do I have to get them all? What happens if I do? What happens if I reptar? Damn it! Can you like stack? So I'm noticing um, like numbers on like the cookie and the beach ball. Can you stack those? Like, could you? Oh no! Could you get multiple beach balls? Or multiple cookies and just like zoom zoom. Reptar! Oh man. I don't need an oil slick to throw myself off. I'm just bad at this. Why be, why always be? Ugh. Don't roll over the dirt. That's such a waste of your speed. Mind you, I'm not good enough to like, break and drift. Oh, maybe I am. Yeah, you just gotta, you just gotta, like, tap the brake a little bit. It's nothing huge. Oh, cool! It looked like I nailed the Reptar with my, uh, with my fucking beach ball. Oh man, I can't tell where I am. Oh, okay, I see me. I'm the green one, right? And Tommy's the light blue? Tommy's fucking good at this. He's just zooming right through. How are you supposed to compete with that child? Like, look at him. There seems to be some, uh, some, like, weird rubber banding going on between, um, Oh, what, what's her name? Angelica and Phil there, but... I don't see Tommy, like, falling back or anything like that. He's just consistently ahead. I guess I just gotta get better at the turns, god damn. How long is this? This is like a fucking three and a half minute race, are you kidding me? This is nuts. Oh, it's longer than that. Holy shit. Oh no! Oh no! I'm getting comboed by the panties. This is not great. Oh, I think you need glasses too. Actually, it's, re it's really gross, because, like, you roll up on it, and it looks like it's, like, filled. If you look on top, it looks like it's fucking filled to the top with, like, yellow stuff. Ugh. It's using hacks. Uh, second place. You didn't win the race. We did better than last time, though. We have a one more shot. One more, and then we'll go play a different minigame. I wonder if we're supposed to, um, I don't know, I wonder if we're supposed to, like, go do a different race, and then maybe we get, like, a better car or something, I don't know. Maybe I just have to be good at it. No, that's me. I am the one who is ahead now. You see how fast he's moving? I don't know if he picked up a speed thing, but wow. 
Oh no! Oh, don't let him get ahead of you. Oh, leave, leave the diaper panties. Damn it! No! Oh, that little bastard. Oh, he's oh, throwing me off. Not that I was on to begin with. Oh, man. Fuck, it's really hard to do this. It's really weird that, like, the camera is a lot more stable um, in this fucking thing. Like, in this racing section than it is just walking around. Oh, man. Okay, I have pulled out in front. I just need to stay in front. Oh, no! No, no, no! You... Oh, you fuck off, Tommy. Oh, who is that? That's Phil? Phil, you fuck off. No. Yeah? You fuck off. <laughs> oh, God. Can I keep this up for another four laps? Jesus. Two, three. Oh, hopefully they'll all hit those oil slicks. I can't tell how my okay I'm doing okay. Oh no. Oh no no oh, no If I hit like any of the the hazards, I'm gonna spin out and they're gonna pass me. I know they will. I just gotta stay ahead of them and I gotta I gotta keep picking up these fucking pickups and dropping them so that they spin out into them. Oh, am I gonna lap Angelica? Oh! Oh, there we go! Come on. Let me pe- Oh. It almost feels like it slows me down a little bit. Wait, no, okay. See, it felt like I was slowing down a little bit, like when I was approaching her, but then... I think that was actually just my boost wearing off. Come on! Alright, one more lap. We can do this. We can do it. Oh, yeah. No! No! Oh, God. I can't do anything if I get stuck on a fucking beach ball. Oh, man. And, like, they're just solid. It's like you hit a wall. What a weird hazard for a fucking racing game. Like, even like combat racing like this, like you just put up a wall? Jesus. Congratulations, you won a key. It's one of eight, I think. Oh! Sky and Lognego are here. Welcome. Welcome, guys. I hope you guys are ready. I hope you're, uh. doing well. I hope you guys are doing well today. You're all good. Um, this guy had said, I had no idea this game existed. Um, like how Angelica is basically Bowser in being the slowest car that you overlap. Um, <laughs> it, that that was that one try. That was that was that one try I did really well. Other than that, the so. Um, Lockneck has said, I thought this was a tour, not Mario Kart. Well, you tour in the cart. You gotta, you gotta tour the raceway scene in the cart. I mean, it's the most efficient way. Um. Don't let me get the last Goger. He's cheating. Swearing in a kid's game. Wow. Uh. You think I'll get to try? Sam said, yay, and on first try. That's right. That's right. One attempt. No other attempt was made. Okay, so I got one key out of that. But there doesn't appear to be anything else in here. I'm not seeing, like, another... Oh, here we go. 
Welcome to the Gigantamongus Desert Speedway. To get okay. to the starting line, speed through the track entrance door. But if your driving skills need a tune-up, make a pit stop at the checkered flag on the ground first, and we'll give you a quick jump start. Okay, desert race scene. So I guess there's a couple of these. Drive them, cowboy! There's not a whole lot in that hub area. It's very bland. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to another hot day at Gigantamongus Desert Speedway. Oh man, so like the road and the dirt look very similar. It's gonna be weird figuring out where I can drive. Ready? Lights, camera, action! Wait, where do I drive? Yeah, you'd better run. Oh, uh-oh. Okay, so we're just between the dunes. The way the dunes are, are piled up, it almost makes me think of, um, like we're in like a construction site or whatever, a quarry maybe. Oh no! I hit my own beach ball! I think three out of four of us slid out on that oil slick. Holy shit, look at that course! I didn't look at the map until uh, until just now, but oh fuck, that's a long one. Also, I'm gonna be amazed if the other racers end up going th Oh man, they did. It looks like they went through that section no problem. You'd, you'd think they would crash. Yuck! What the hell, did I just crash? On a on a reptar, man. So it looks like Tommy and Chucky are like neck and neck up there. So if I can pass one, I can pass the other. But the question is, can I make it and catch up to either one of them? Urgh! I love the growls that come out of the reptars when you grab them. I don't know what they're for. I have no idea what the Reptars do. Do we trade them in for a key, maybe? I have no clue. Roar. Man, I feel like I just learned how to take the corners properly like with the break and everything on the last course and now all of a sudden like you can actually just like steer around them you don't even need to break like completely does away with the skills I just learned oh come on does the pink one make you slide out or is that because I hit the the tumbleweed or what I didn't know there was a boost thing right there. There's one there, though. Hey! Oh, man, this is a long course. How many laps are there? Four? Okay. That's reasonable. If it's, a, if it's such a long course, then that makes better sense. Alright, who did I catch up to? Nobody? That is... it's gotta be Tommy, isn't it? That's Tommy. I gotta pass him. I gotta get past that son of a bitch! Woo! Hasta la vista, babies! Uh. Whoa! Did I do it? Did I do it? I'm in second. Okay. I gotta catch up to Chucky now. How far ahead is he? Oh, he's not that far. I can get him. He's like right there. He hit the oil slick like a chump. Oh, this is it. Oh, no. No, 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 no. Moment of truth time and I hit a wall. That was the truth of it all, is that I, I was meant to crash and burn. 
Rawr. What is the Reptar for? I'd really like to cash it in for something, and I think that was my own diaper. I think that's the one that I dropped. Unfortunately, all of the... Um... Like, the oil slick in the diapers that I lay down now aren't going to mean anything. Probably should have saved that beach ball, like, for right now so we can hit him. Drop the diaper in front of him. Hey! And just like that, Angelica takes first place. Passing by the nerd Chucky. Oh no! And Chucky reclaims his place. That little shit. Oh god damn it. Damn it, get back on the track. Oh, that's real bad. Do I have enough time to catch up? Catch up and overtake that little fucker. Not if I ran ran into the wall. Oh no. No, 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 no. Oh, he passed the finish line. That son of a bitch. Oh, that little fucker. I didn't lose. So I close. Didn't win as much as so I close. This would be a long Mario Kart section? Probably. Probably. You'd think that they would die in that area. In the desert? Probably. The diaper aspect is actually kind of gross. A little bit, yeah. But that's that, like, gross kid humor that was in a lot of these old games. Like, um... Like, I don't know if you guys remember, like, the South Park game that came out, like, for the PlayStation and the N64, etc. Um, but that, um... That game, like, you throw snowballs in it. It, 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 it had, like, a shooting mechanic. It was, like, a, like a GoldenEye ripoff or whatever. Um, you could, uh, you could throw snowballs as, like, your default projectile weapon. Um, but you could, like, you, you could tap a button and then piss on the snowball and, th like, and then throw it at your enemy. Super gross and like super unnecessary, but like it'll it'll make the kids laugh, right? Or the whoever that, that's playing that game. That was one of those games like I played it once and I couldn't find any real indication of what I was supposed to do. Or, or how to do it, so just turned it off, never played it again. <laughs> and oddly enough, it was a game that, like, um, for a while, people talked a lot about. And they're like, oh my god, have you played the South Park game? And I'm like, yeah, I, just, I don't get it. I think, I think the hype was, like, because it was South Park. Hey, Reptars! Got him! Oh, man. I don't want to get too full of myself, but I feel like because I'm ahead here, I can uh, comfortably, like, swerve and try to collect the Reptar things instead of trying to collect the power-ups. And not sure what they're for, but you know, if we need them, it'll be good to have them instead of having to come back through here and uh, do this all again. Mind you, if we have to come back here and do it again to get the rest of the reptars, um, not having to come in first to get the key is gonna help. I love the the really simple like banjo picking in the background there. Like your old fashioned getaway music. There's a lot of diapers on this highway now. 
I don't know what highway this is, but like I, th this is a deterrent for for driving. As somebody who like doesn't drive, and people are like, "Oh, well, you should drive." Like, "Oh yeah, yeah," on a road full of diapers, <laughs> diapers in the middle, piss jugs on the side. What a wonderful country drive. Oh no, oh no, I crashed into the diaper. I think they're supposed to make you, yeah, swerve out like that. But instead... It's a big crash. All crash, no bandicoot. Oh no. Oh no! Oh no! Did these little buggers know where the goddamn uh, zoom mats, the <laughs> zoom mats, the uh, the boosts are? Do they do they know the locations and like how to hit them? Now, what does the pink one do? I don't know what the pink uh, arrows do, because it looks like... You'd think they would boost, but it doesn't look like they do that. Oh, oh. I seen him. I seen Chucky. Oh, we have like half a track left to get caught up to him. Use the beach ball, damn it! Oh, because I'm gonna crash into it. That's why, oh, god damn. God damn it. Oh, he got hit. He hit the oil slick. Fuck you. How is it that I hit him and I'm the one that gets booted off the side? Oh! Smashing into the cactus. Fuck. Come on. He's gonna win. A little shit, he's gonna win. Because I keep crashing into the side. Oh, damn it. Well, that's depressing. I did so well on that one. And at the beginning. And then I just... <laughs> South Park and the Stick of Truth asks Firefox. Uh, no, no. Um, I think I played the Stick of Truth, but no. I was talking about um, South Park game that came out uh, for the PlayStation One and the N sixty four. Ready? Lights, camera. Real old game. Hey, you can't pass me. I'm the boss. That's right. That, that show, Who's the Boss, that was all about Angelica. I have no idea what that show is about. What? Oh, he just reset. He got so fucked on the dunes that he reset. I think it's best to just hold on to the beach ball and not use it. Wait till you can trade it out for something else. Yeah. Roar. Reptar. God, what do those pink arrows do? It confuses the hell out of me. I wonder if they're like... Like it's a boost, but it's drained? Like it only works if you're... Or, yeah, maybe it only works if you're... Not in first. Mm. Okay, we're doing good. We're we're leaving them in our dust. We just gotta oh, just gotta play it cool. Gonna not go too far out of my way 
to get these uh, these reptars. I don't want to end up crashing into a into like a wall or a cactus or something. There we go. A lot of diapers. Real gross. I hope that they end up hitting them on this next run through. Because otherwise I'm going to hit them and I don't want that. <laughs> There's going to be a whole series of diapers to run into one after another. Four beach balls? I really don't want that. There we go. One oil slick. Three out of four laps. Okay, not bad. Doing not too bad. Feeling good about feeling good. God, I can't believe we started with this. This is probably, like, the worst decision to start with these ones. And, like, you could tell by looking at it, too, that it was, like, a racing thing. The goddamn tumbleweeds. Oh, they suck. Real hard they do. It's okay. Ooh, just barely avoided those cactuses. Cacti? The cacti, yeah. If it was running, it'd be cactuar. Alright, one more lap. I can do this. I can do this. Believe and Habib, guys. Why isn't it? Oh, right. Fuck. I'm hitting the circle button trying to drop the diaper and it's not going. Because that's not the right one. You'd think just once I could play a game and learn the controls. Oops. Although it's probably not going to help that this is a series of mini-games that's going to have different controls for each one. Well, oh, that one area has so many diapers, and, like, it's weird because, like, it's such a, like, windy, turny area. You'd figure if they were going to get caught up on them in any one spot, it would be, like, there. Speed through. Uh, yeah, there we go. Switch out that beach ball for something useful. The Woo! There we go. Two keys. Um, Firefox said, by the way, will you ever play any of the South Park games yes, in stream? I did it! Um, uh, probably not. Probably not. I played the, uh, the Stick of Truth, and there's some stuff in that that's just not appropriate. Like, and it starts very early on. Like, very early. Go west, young man! Do the race course! Like, one of the classes in Stick of Truth uh, that you can start as is, like, a super offensive stereotype. And it's, it, like, it's super fucked, because you've got, like, you've got Warrior, and you got Mage, I think? Or, or Thief? You, you've got two generic classes, like Warrior, Mage, Thief, whatever, and then the third class is offensive stereotype. Welcome to Gigantamongus. It's really weird. To start a race and scurry on through you the four? 
But if you're new, oh, okay, there's just the four in there. Set a spell on the checkered flag, and I'll learn your real Bayou good. Racing. Wait, okay, so we did the... We did this one, right? Yeah, there we go. Yeah, it's Warrior Mage, Thief, and the Offensive One. Thank you, Firefox. Get to the track, boy. Don't make me loss of you. Yeah, I've not played the uh, the and other one, the sequel to it. Um, but I don't have a whole lot of faith in that being any more appropriate than the first game. So no, we'll probably not play any South Park. Sweep the track, boys. We got visitors. It's one thing to be like edgy and and vulgar and, and gross or whatever in your game, right? But, like, to just straight up be, like, racially insensitive and offensive to people, like, it's... Let's not have that. Alright. So this is, like, the mid-track, huh? This is, like... The, the medium. I, I guess the raceway was like level one, this is level two, and then the desert would have been three. Since it's a shorter course, hopefully it'll be easier to catch up to people. This one's got some wild turns on it, man. Oh no! Oh no! You gotta be real careful. Irma Gerd, girl, be careful. How many laps? Oh, we only have to do three laps on this one, too. That's not bad. So it's shorter than the desert one, and you only have to do three laps instead of four? That's way better. Am I hitting mud patches? Is that what that is? They're acting like the oil slick, but it's just a mud patch? Okay. I guess I can try to keep my eye out for those and try to not go in the water. That sucks. Be careful with that. What is that? What is that, like, sauce bottle? Am I... Am I becoming invincible for a time? Or am I... Leaving an oil slick? Like, what is that? What did I do? What did I slip on? Okay, that time I hit a diaper. Just random diaper in the road. Fuck, I'm way behind these guys. I'm worried about my ability to catch up to this. Oh, fuck. Okay. So I know where that one is. Ooh, damn it. There's... Another one. So I guess you gotta, like, learn where they all are, and then... Fucking avoid them all. That, uh, that previous area there where it, like, dips down into the water. Fucking pain in the ass. Throws me off. What does that do? What does the sauce bottle do? Is it invincible sauce? That sounds like it'd be spicy. Like I like I could put it on a steak or something. Oh, you can make jerky with it. Invincible sauce jerky. Oh. I don't even know what flavor that would be, but it sounds good. Just jerky sounds good. <laughs> and third place. Okay. I'm getting it though. I'm getting the I'm getting the the thing of it. The path. Gotta be real curveful. Curveful round the curves. Lights, camera. camera, action, 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 action. I'm unstoppable. Okay. 
So let's try to stay out in front this time. Because it seems like I like I pulled out in front before, and I did okay, and then I immediately like crashed, and got super fucked up, and how did she fucking pass me? You are the pitch lady. Come on. Ooh, diapers all over the place. Damn. The invincible sauce is real confusing. I'd really like to know what it actually does. Part of me wants to, like, save it and try to, like, run through a patch of mud with it, but I also don't want to run through a patch of mud and lose my lead. Because that would suck. I barely want to glance at the map to see how I'm doing. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. Oh no, oh no! I just know that as long as I'm not hitting mud patches and I'm not seeing anybody pass me, that's good. Oh god, not the beach ball, no. Anything but the beach ball. There we go, diaper. Diaper for you. There. Almost around the curve. There we go. One more lap. We can do this. This one's nice and short. I like that. It's short, but like, there's a tension in the air. And the tension makes it seem like it's a lot longer than it actually is. You take every turn, like, second by second. I feel more focused on this than I have been on, like, any game in, in I don't know how long. Oh, come on. We're so close. Almost there. Almost there. Hey, and I finished with 69 Reptars. Ha <laughs> ha. Uh, baller. Four keys. Four keys, that's wonderful. I got a key. And now, maybe you'll open that security door. Are we, are we able to open it now that we have four keys? I feel like that's... Come on now, we're waiting. I can do this. I feel like if we go into the other areas, we're gonna have get to drive? like way too many keys at the end. <laughs> that was so exciting! I gotta get my diaper changed. <laughs> Ooh, man! I raced so hard, I fucking shit myself, man. You know when you just go so fast? Okay, so does this... Two... Wait. Press select to exit, press circle to save? Would you like to create a Rugrat save file? Yes. Creating save game. Checking for save game. Creating save game check. The save game game has been saved. Excellent. And it's. Hold on. I always forget this command. What is it? E P. E. Save state button. Uh, press F1 to save. Oh. Wait for it. It'll fix itself, I promise. 
dun, 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 dun. Well, that was jank, wasn't it? Let's move on to something else. Let's check out Captain Cookies. Arr, off to the pirate thing, whatever the fuck it be. It's showtime, babies! Arr, ahoy, matey, your lady! The Captain Cookie's crew is ready to set sail. Go through yonder doors and choose a set to start filming. See you on the set, landlubber. Is this guy, like, the same? The star is supposed to be late. Is this, is this the same guy in each area, just like wearing a different costume? That sucks. Hurry it's unfortunate up, that he has a job like that. Time soon. Okay, so we just go in any one of these rooms? Hope you don't got any wooden legs, matey! But if you do, <laughs> polish them up! Laces pirate places. If you be ready to film the captain, laces pirate places. What is this? Finding pirate treasure is as easy as walking the plank. Just grab all the treasure on the beach before your time runs out. I'm oh. Rich. <laughs> oh, it's just like a coin collector. Beard. This is a pirate ship, not a museum. Treasure it collecting, so scene treasure. one. Cool. All right. This is, yeah. Nice and simple, I like that. Way better than that fucking driving. Hey! Ready? Light camera. Camera action. Okay. So I have less than a minute to pick up all of the coins. Was that all of the Reptar? No, that's a Reptar. Two. One. That was real simple. I can't believe how quick that went. Sail indeed. Uh, the camera sucks? Yeah. Yeah, I told you. I done told you, man. So we have, like, just over a minute now to collect more? Why does it... There we go. 18, 17... Oh. 16... One. No idea what these reptars are for, but that's okay. Shit. Oh, no. Yeah, oh no is right. Oh, I didn't need to go up and over. I could have gone around. Well, that's a dumb. Oh man, I missed a reptar. Come on, Susie. Run. Oh, there's one left. And I've got seconds. I've got enough seconds to miss everything that I'm trying to get. This is neat. That was so bad. I fucking hate that. Oh, I should have hit square to walk. Oh, that would have made things easier. I'm dumb. Ready? Lights, camera, action! Yo ho ho, get the coins, you know. Arr! What? They put an eye patch over his glasses like he doesn't have enough trouble seeing. Or maybe he sees perfectly fine because of the glasses? I don't... I don't know. <laughs> I just feel like that's a weird thing to do. Like, doesn't... Doesn't the glasses already imply that he has a visual impairment? Oh! Uh, crabs? Why did it have to be crabs? Oh man, a crab just fucked my shit up. Crabs are awful. Stay away from them. You gotta get the... You get the proper shampoo to keep them off your back. And other places. Damn it! Okay. 
Okay, there's coins over here that I missed. Oh man, this camera is the worst. I hate that I hit the crabs. Oh, so close. Would you like to try again? I think we can do it. I think we can manage. Ready? Lights. Dun, 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 dun. Yo ho ho, yo ho ho, do 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 do. Yes, get caught up on all of this shit. Okay. <laughs> I'm not gonna spend too much time going after the reptars. Cause that is how you fuck it up. Damn it! Um, could you please move, Mr. Crab? Okay, and let's go, let's go up and get all of these first, and then we can like drop off the side. Yeah! Go around, get all of these ones first. Run the crab if we can. A little fucker. He's just gonna try to make this difficult, didn't he? Ah! But I'm not done yet. What's this horse shit? Another collecting scene. That's okay. Ready? Lights. Action! It's like Banjo Kazooie on a timer. Help! The crabs are after Tommy! No! What's in here? A reptar. And coins. Man, there's a lot more coins in here. And there's like a creepy pirate clown doll thing? Yeah. That thing is fucking terrifying. To hell with that. This jank ass clown monster. Why would they put that in a children's game? Why, why would they put some like horrifying clown demon robot in in a cave where young Tommy's just gonna run into it and be like, ah, my diaper, it runneth over. Cave are. Ooh, there's a pink reptar. Hey, what about that? I have 40 seconds to get like the rest of those reptars. That's all right. Is that all that I missed? Huh? 20 seconds. Let's go get it. Let's get that last coin. And it is right there. Number, um, Hell yeah. I'm the <laughs> Shaggy's Rock is here. Welcome. Welcome, how are you? Hope all is well. I'm good. Um, Shaggy's Rock asks, is this a Taco Bell? It is now. We're, we're glimpsing Move the past. We're glimpsing the past of, uh, of this studio here, uh, when once it was a studio, but for now, in our time, it has since become a Taco Bell. Treasure hunt scene one, door open. Do you only get one... Hold on. I want to do all the doors lead into, like, the same area. Tag scene? Foot race scene. Hold on. Hold on, we did treasure hunting in there. Is there more than... Is there more than one? We did this one, right? 
Treasure collecting scene one. We did that one already. Hurry up, matey! It's gonna be your bedtime soon. Arr! And then you go down for the nappy naps. Treasure hunt scene one. Oh, I guess it's another treasure hunt. Okay. Um, before we do that. Ah, uh, yes. Indeed. My dinner is ready. Uh, I'm going to tab over real quick, <laughs> grab my eats, and I'll be back in just a second. Okay, guys? Don't go nowhere. Arr, I be back with me foods. Arr. All right, treasure hunt scene one. Woo woo! Give me a second here. Hurry up, matey! It's gonna be your bedtime soon. All right, all right. Hold your ponies, Captain. Dig in, matey. Ready? Mm. Camera. I was gonna ask, yeah. Is it like the same game? But like a different... Huh? What is this? What am I supposed to do in here? Am I like... Exploring a map? What is this? Good, fine, There's a blue key. Okay. Key for your effort. So I gotta take that, probably do a blue lock, I would imagine. As, you know, puzzle game logic dictates. My god. <laughs> Trying to grab a thing and just circling around it is, like, so frustrating. Rawr, rawr, rawr. Love Reptar. I always wanted to know what a Reptar bar would taste like. Like, what kind of... What kind of candy bar is it? Is it like chocolate? Is it like actually candy? Is it like... A granola something? Like what? A second blue key. Hmm. My god. There is a secret pathway behind a waterfall. As there should be in video games. This one, not so much. This one? Yeah, there you go. Love that. That's how it should be. Ooh, ooh hey, look at that. Looks like the arrows are just gonna guide me straight to the thing. Unless... Wait, no, they split off in different directions now. Oh no! That dumb crab... ...just... ...lost me a key. 
Does that mean I have to go back and get it now? Yeah, it's like back in the chest. That's so weird. Good find, matey. He gets a key for your effort. So do I have to... Should I, like, crush all of the... Because you can jump. Can you jump on the crabs and destroy them? Because that would be ideal, right? Take them all out and then... And then you can do your, your collection of the keys. And how many of these reptars is there? And what are they for? Is that just, like, to keep score? Is that just... Something else to do? Like what? Don't forget, you'll be needing four blue keys to open the final treasure chest. Ah, four blue keys, huh? It'd be real cool if I could look straight ahead. Pass the robot. Collect the reptars. And go into the waterfall. Cool. Oh, yeah. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. There we go. I wonder how many of these are in a single level. Like, more or less th than 50. It'd probably be like 50 or 100, I would imagine. Is this like the last area? Yeah, I think that, uh... I think that shortcut robbed me of my, uh... Some of my progress here. I still need to find a key. Where or where do I find the key? I think I can remember doing this one as a kid and just not understanding what the point was. I kept getting got by the the crabs as well. It's like anytime you get a key, it's gone. And then what do you do? I think I tried once to like clear out the whole area, like get the map all uh, all labeled out and then and then get the keys. Oh, you son of a bitch. I'll show you something really scary, like this. Alright, well that one is like relatively close, isn't it? That that map seems like it's gonna like just wind into the end there, so I should probably go back and grab this one while I have the opportunity to. Oh no! Pirate Robo! Open the chest. Good find, matey. He gets a key Can I climb this? Effort. No. It's weird that you can't climb that. You'd, you'd think, right? Although, was that something that was in Vidges at this time? I don't know. I don't know if climbing was a uh, prevalent game mechanic or not. We gotta remember, this is like really early, like, PlayStation era shit. Okay, I get the feeling that that is the way to the final thing. Which means that the chest with the key in it is probably down here somewhere. I would think. Of course, I have thought wrong on occasion. Uh oh. Oh no, caught between a robot and a crab. Oh man. What do you do? God, if I had better control over my camera, this would be no problem. Alas. Hey. Hey. Ooh. Ooh, pink reptar. Is that like the last of the reptars? No, because there's more. The final treasure chest. Cut, cut, cut. Take uh oh. 
feel the pot. What happened there? Okay, the map says that the chests have still been opened, so... So what do I do here, huh? Oh, man. Talk about starting at the bottom. Okay, you can j jump while you're moving. You just gotta be quicker at it, I guess. Yeah, you just gotta be quicker with it. Cut, cut, cut! Talk about starting at the bottom. Oh, excuse me. I feel like I'm chugging on my pork chop a little bit there. Okay. Oh, damn it. <laughs> Almost, kid. Ooh. Give it another shot. I had the timing right. I just didn't have the angle on that one. Okay. Line it up. And jump. Damn it. <laughs> Let's try that scene again, kid. This is rather cool, though. They got, like, the mattress there. And, like, the, the reloading. It's just like her falling on it. Caught, caught. You suck, kid. Oh man. Jumping into the wall. It's like, who the fuck hired this kid? She can't jump worth a shit. Let's try that scene again, kid. I keep thinking I have, like, the room for it. And, like, you gotta hit it way earlier. Oh, yeah. Just barely made that one. What do you do here? Oh, that's the final one. But I know that there's other Reptar shits that I missed. If I get that now, then I miss the Reptars. So let's grab the Reptars first, shall we? Cut, cut, cut. Hey, kid. Feel the pot. Hey, where does that start me now? Oh, it puts me back here. Perfect. Oh, no! Was that 91? So I assume that there's like nine more that I'm missing. Just somewhere. Where? I don't know. Maybe they'll be in the chest there if I'm lucky. Yeah, I think I just like straight up missed them. Unless. Nope, they're not behind it? Okay. You have enough reptar bars to redeem a key. Oh, cool. Ready? Light camera action! The hell? Do I have to do this again? As Chucky now? Oh, man. Okay. Don't forget! You'll be needing four blue keys to open the final treasure chest. Four blue keys, okay. Well, at least it doesn't seem like there's a... Like, there's no puzzles to do. There's no, um... Come on. Yeah, like, like there's no, uh... Impeding your progress. Like there is in a lot of other games. The only slowdown is my own inability to play the game. <laughs> this is where we started. Okay. So that means this is the exit. Okay. I like that that first area was so simple and contained. Hey, look at that. Just 
picked up a key. Does that count, though? Like... No, it says I have one. So what is that? Was that like a purple key? It's not the blue one? What is the purple key for? Oh, I'm trapped. Does the purple key open a chest that like has a blue key in it, maybe? We're getting into some Resident Evil shit now with these puzzles. Oh boy. Who designed this movie studio? Fucking Spencer's? Or the guy that Spencer hired? Who, who I guess died on the estate, locked away in one of his own traps? Oh no. Oh no, the robot is gonna get me! Not if I- uh oh. Actually, he is totally gonna get me if I get cornered like that. Okay. That was interesting. Weird little grass maze. I like that it was like just high enough for him to get lost in, but like anybody larger than a foot tall could see over it. What do we have here? Oh. I have a key! Woo. That's fantastic. Apologize while I shove food into my ravenous maw. Alright, can I make this jump? Can Chucky do it? No, he can't. Let's Chucky is just as bad game. at the platforming as Angelica. And by Chucky, I mean me. And by Angelica, I also mean me. <laughs> yeah, alright, here we go. Walk. I don't like that. That's too close to the edge. This is something you really want to take slow. Oh, fuck. Cut, cut, cut. There's Damn no it. such thing as instant success. Search me all the way back up here? God damn, dude. It's merciless. All right. Oh, cut, damn it. Cut, cut. Hey, kid. Feel the pot. Feel it. Don't think it. Use your instincts. And, ha! There we go. Ha ha! Ha ha! Alright, I can see... I can see the other chests on the map. Whether or not I can actually get to them, though. What? What's over there? Oh, man. Those have got to be in, like, a secret area behind a waterfall. I wonder if I can, like, jump to it. No, that's too far away. That's super too far. I went the wrong way. This is a way to come back. Cut. What? Let's did I land on it and just clip game. through, or did I, like, sail right over it? Wait, where did it put me? Oh, it put me here. Okay, well, that's cool. <laughs> Alright. Uh. Alright, that's the big chest there. Is this the secret pathway behind the waterfalls? No, it's the secret pathway right here. Which is nowhere. I guess I could try jumping to that ledge. Or like jumping through the waterfall from that one ledge. 
It seems like that last chest might actually be in the waterfall somewhere, so who knows? I gotta hear that pirate guy speak again. Well, I almost wonder if he's the same pirate guy from the SpongeBob intro. Are you ready, kids? I can't hear you. We'll have to hear his voice a little bit. Or possibly look at the credits, I don't know. One of the two. Alright, line it up and... Blah! Cut! Let's try that Did I jump too it. short on that? What was the deal with that one? Oh, hey, since I'm here... Ha! Oh. <laughs> I wanted to try and Let's jump try into the waterfall. We'll see how this goes. Oh, damn it. It looks Talk like if you, uh... If you're not careful, you can, like, sail right over it. Alright, fuck it. <laughs> that gap seems like it's too big to make anyways. I don't imagine that there's actually a, a ledge behind there. It'd have to be lower for you to be able to land on it like that. There we go. Open the chest, loser. Okay. So the other one is there. And he hey, what do we have here? Is this the secret path all the way over to that ledge? I think it is. Ooh. Yeah, there we go. We did it. We got all the reptars. Go us. I'd like to know what they are. I don't know what happened. I won. Oh, they're reptar bars. Okay. I was gonna say, are they reptar bars? Are they stickers? Are they like what? Ready? Light camera action! Man, how many of these are there? Mmm. Okay. So we got... Yeah, we got free keys for that, huh? We might be able to open the door and save Dill already. Um... Whoops, have you figured out what the dinosaurs are? Ask Sky. Yeah, um, they're reptar bars. Uh, I guess they're like chocolate of some sort. How do I get in there? That's clearly blocked off by something. How do I... Well, it doesn't matter. So if the reptar bars are to offer you... Um, it seems like if you get a hundred of them... You can call, trade them in for a free key in case you're having trouble beating one of the beating with like any of the levels here. This in particular seems to be like hunt down the reptar bars so that you can just get free keys. Also, there's going to be a key at the end probably. But we don't actually need all that many. I mean, what do we need? We needed four more after what we initially started with. And now we have five? <laughs> oh, those crates are how you deal with it. Okay. 
the crates will be how you get uh, in over the that blocked area. We'll probably stack them up. Good find, he gets I would imagine that's what you do with them. Open the chest. There we go. Blue keys is... to open the final treasure chest. What is that? Oh, is that supposed to be lava? That's weird because it almost looked like the gold texture that they used like inside the chest. Good the big find, one. Matey. He gets a key for your effort. Uh, this guy said, "Oh, so this was literally made for five-year-olds." <laughs> Jax Rock says, "I'm not five years old." Hey now, hey. I mean, man. I mean, kids want to play games too, <laughs> and and oftentimes kids suck at video games. So what do you do? You give them a game with a shit awful camera um, that makes them have an even harder time than they normally would. So it just ruins their experience. Now it looks like. Hold on. Hold on, Tommy. Yeah, there's totally reptars over there, but how do I... Oh. Oh. I have a... An idea. I wonder. Can I use the boxes? Oh, he just climbs on top of it. Oh, hey, yeah. Oh, man, and it's like actually just like grab... It's not even, like, pick up, it's, like, he grabs it. Nope, nope, can't do that, okay. Well, you know what, I'm gonna pick that up. No, I'm gonna, I'm gonna pick it up. No, I'm gonna pick it up, if I can. Is this okay? No, that's not okay. No, that's that's super not okay. All right. I do believe there's like a ledge over here that maybe I can place it in front of. Try to climb up on the ledge. It looks like it just goes into sort of like a hole or something though. Ah, here we go. Boing. Uh, log neck is I'm pretty sure kids won't get this even if it has that. Uh, the only thing it does help adults who can't tolerate this. Um. Oh, that wasn't meant to be shade. <laughs> no, I, I had a decent handle on this as a kid. Like, like, getting... It's, it's a little odd, like, unless you hit the square that tells you what you're supposed to do. You don't really know, like, your controls or, or what you're doing for some of these. Um, but, like, it's not that hard to get a hold of. It's just the the camera is really jank. And, of course, as a child, having no concept of, like, spacing and timing and looking where you're going, it's a lot harder as a kid. Look like there's anything. It's just like a flat texture there. What is this? Can I? Is that telling me? Hold on. Can I pick up a box? I would really like to pick up a box. I guess not. I'm not allowed to pick up a box. Not that one. Oh, man, we got three out of four keys. And I see where the fourth one is. I just have to make this stupid platforming. What? Ah, there we go. <laughs> I'm super impressed with the uh, these kids' ability to jump. I mean, they can go pretty decently, like a lot more. Like you wouldn't expect. 
Babby's as young as they are to be able to like run and jump, but here they are tracking and fielding it up. Tommy's tracking all the fields. Ah! There we go. Yeah, I'm not even gonna worry about like the other red car bars. I'm number Um I'm the bestest. Because he does know how to count. Okay. Hurry up, matey. It's so we did time. the treasure hunts. Both I'm of them. Both Let's all of go, them. Meaty. But there's the other side of the hallway, too. What do we have here? There's two other doors. So what do we got? We've got... Tag scene... And foot race. Up, matey. It's gonna be your bedtime soon. Let's do the foot race. And run for me. I assume you just run. You just run past dudes. Press R1 to use power ups. Okay. Ready? Like camera. Action. Yeah, it's just a foot race, but but with power ups. This is nuts. So, since we have enough keys to open the thing, I'm not gonna worry too hard, like, if we fail this. We'll, ju we'll just try it out. And, and if we lose, then, then we'll just say fuck it. Because we can totally open the door already. Oh man, I slipped on the bananas. And collecting all these Reptar bars is totally unnecessary. Oh man, we're so slow. Does it... Man, Susie, like, totally cheated. She cut across the grass and she didn't slow down. She's actually, like, picking up speed. What is this? Look at that! She's totally picking up speed! She's, like, pulling ahead of me. This is dumb. What is this rubber banding bullshit? How am I still on the first lap, too? Is that it up there? Is that the start line? There's the start, right? That's the start line. That's gotta be it. Ugh. You take the outside track. That's fine. I'm taking the inside. That's how you do it. We're out of here. <laughs> oh, missed it. Whoa! I don't understand how that pink arrow thing works. Does it work at all? Does it do a thing, or does it do no thing? Man, he he barely hit the diaper. Phil just, like, knocked the diaper, and then, like, it was done with it. It was done. Just fuck it. There are two of them side by side. Oh, I won't let you beat me, you son of a bitch. No, oh, you fuck off. You get out of here. No. No, you eat shit. Eat shit, I'll bet you do. No, why is he pulling ahead of me? You piece of shit. No, no, why is he pulling ahead of me? No, fucker. Oh man. So like he just like picks up speed when they pass you. That sucks. And it's not like I hit a whole lot of obstacles and got caught up along the way. That was shitty. Okay, I was Robert. All right, 
wait, no. No, we just did... What the hell? We just did the foot race. We did the foot race and we came out of that door, so why was the door directly ahead of me, the foot race door? Exit to Captain Cookies. Yar, ahoy, crunch me, mateys. Okay. Oh, well. <gasps> oh no, it's because you anyway. start over here on this side. Okay. So that's the foot race door. Hurry up, that makes this one the tag scene. All for one, and one for me. So what is tag? I mean, I know what tag is, but like, what is this game? Do I actually have to like, like run around, touch a guy, and then like? Lights, camera. Oh, so it's like three and a half minutes of tag. I have to actually play tag with these kids. Oh, man. Man, digital tag is like... This is way better than having to like actually run around and play tag. It's bedtime. I was always slower. Than everybody else as a kid, um, I had uh, I had slight asthma as a kid, um, and wasn't <laughs> wasn't very like into sports or anything. So I can run very fast. So like playing uh, like tag or anything of the sort, um, it just kind of sucked. You're always like the first one caught, and then that means that you're it, and then you never catch anybody. And then it's no fun, because you're just running around exhausting yourself. So I did touch Phil or Lil or whoever, right? Did I... Did I get somebody? Oh, there's two of them here. Nope. Go this way. Fight. Yeah, let's, let's get Susie there. What happens if I run into Susie? But I'm too young to oh, she gets eliminated. Okay. Okay, so. Yeah, you do want to use the map and fucking see your way around here. I didn't realize that shortcut was right there. I can totally do this. Come on. Oh, Chucky. You're gonna... I'm gonna get you. Gotcha. So this is not tag as I remember. This is something else, I think. And you're out of there. Um, so as far as I remember, it, like, tag is, like, very similar to this. Like, you, like, one person is it, and they run around, and they touch somebody. And then that person is it. And they have to, like, then run and tag somebody else. Um, usually there's a rule of, like, no tag backs. So, like, you can't just, like, hit the person that got you and then run away. Um, this, though, where, like, the person who's it has to run around and catch everybody. Um, We played like a variation of that. Um, we, we played a game like we called it Manhunt. Um, where like, like that, where like, you have to catch everybody, but every time you catch somebody, they get added to your team. Then the people you caught like help you hunt down everybody else. Yeah, like just getting everybody by yourself and just like eliminating them. I don't know, I don't think we ever played that. I don't think we had a name for that. Okay, so there's the... Hey! Hey! Who wants to play Cowboys and Indians? There's the Western thing, and Mom's then there's the Space thing. Gun, it's gonna be quiet. So let's... Bloop! And I'm gonna drop one in there. And we'll save. Da, 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 pop. 
What happened there? Uh oh. Oh, did the game crash? I hope not. I didn't even hit the save state. It just, like, saved properly. Dun, 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 dun. Okay. That time I hit the save state button. Okay, so we have we have the keys to finish that, I think. We'll just check out what the rest of these minigames are. Have us a good old time of it, I guess. Yeah, this is the same guy. This is the same dude at every desk. He's like, he sees, like, he's, like, sitting in the window, and he's like, what studio are they going into? They're going into the western one? Okay, I, I gotta put on the cowboy costume. And he's like, he's, like, getting dressed in the hallway as he's running to the studio to meet them at the door. Guy's working hard. Of course, then, like, he, he greets us at the entrance. And then we come in, and he just like... I don't, I don't know, he, he just sort of like yells at us through the intercom most of the time it seems. What is this? Gold mine, what is that? Ain't nothing easier than steering one of these here mine carts. Except maybe just sitting in them. Just press left or right to turn or lean to reach those nuggets push it forward or backwards to go well forward and backwards okay press the triangle button to turn on the flashlight when those ghost carts are closing in on you and let's see here oh the x button helps you jump over stuff on the tracks collect the gold before time runs out okay Where it's another one of those of mine? collection things we'll try it out we'll see how it do Y'all come back now, you hear? Actually, <laughs> if we just walk around and we hit all of those tutorial squares, it There's shows off how the game is going to be played, else. and like that's Drive that's all we really need, right? Pick up the gold nuggets. Watch out for the ghost carts. Four minutes and ten seconds to find thirty gold nuggets. Ready? Light camera. Okay, and so our uh, <clears throat> we've got a battery at the top there. Showing us, like, how many times we can zap the dudes. But, like... Huh. Okay, so I used it. I used the, the flashlight, but then... But, but now I have no flashlight. I used it once. I'm a little confused. Do I find batteries? Hey, give me that hey! They're stealing my taters, they are. Oh! Okay, so you gotta tap it. I made the mistake of holding it last time. That's the problem. How is it that I've... Did I wait too long to hit the button on that one? Hey, give that back. I guess I'm waiting too long. I guess my timing is really bad with that one. He's coming right for me. He's coming right for me! Bad ghost. What's popping out of me if I don't have any? Also, what is down here? What happens if, like, you collect all of the taters, but then the dumb ghost-ass, bitch-ass ghosty guys dick you out of, out of all your taters? Oh, no. Got one, like on my ass now. Alright. 
point. Let's see if we can't lose them in the caves there. Yeah, they have no idea where I am. Good. Wait, why can't I... Hold on. Huh, so there's n There's a track that leads into the wall, but... But the wall just does nothing. Okay. <clears throat> what do we have over here? Anything? Okay. Woo! Yeah, battery. So do I have to like make it to the But I'm too young to retire. You didn't collect enough gold in time. Would you like to try again? No. No, that kinda sucked. Coming soon, lazy saddles. Yeah, that was lazy. Very lazy. To just be like, nah. But that's okay. Because it's not a very good minigame. <laughs> I don't care for that one. What is, what is this one over here? But we're using real animals for this here barnyard scene. Round up. Huh? It's like a petting zoo gone crazy. There's critters loose all over the barnyard. Round them all up by using the circle button to pick them up and put them down. You don't have all day, so watch that timer. This okay. Easy part. So actually, super poke. easy. Round You're up the animals. Poke. Chase them down, pick them up, put them in a pan. Get along, little Susie. Mmm. Do we actually have the skills to pay these bills? It's like a petting zoo gone I mean, these crazy. are these There's are some pretty high bills. All over the barnyard. Round them all up by using the circle button to pick them up and put them down. You don't have all day, so watch that timer. What was the point of hitting the tutorial square beforehand if he was just going to tell us how to do it at the beginning? I'm good. Okay, and now that I have it, now that I have this chick, where does it go? Is it? Oh, it just go there, huh? So chicks and bunnies. You got a rabbit. They belong in the other pen. Oh, you gotta sort them. Okay. This is actually really easy. This is way easier than the gold nugget thing. And yet. Somehow I'm gonna manage to screw it up. You know it. You know I will. Gotcha. And you are the last of the chicks. Bam. Bun Bunny, pick it up. Man, why are there so many candy bars? Just like strewn about this uh, this movie studio across how many different sets like four different sets or sorry no four different lots that have um, like two or three different sets on them apiece what's the deal there why are there just like chocolate all over Oh! Uh, how do I, how do I pronounce this? Jesus Digante has followed as of seven minutes ago. Excellent. Excellent. Welcome. Welcome. How are you? Hope you're well. Hope you're enjoying your stay in the bone pit. I gotta say, there's been, uh... <laughs> There's been some people popping in for this one today, and I'm kind of surprised. <laughs> I didn't think this old-ass Rugrats game was going to be so popular today. Gotcha. But there you go. There you go. I'm gonna get you. Pick up the chicks. Tommy here. He's a pro at picking up chicks. Still in diapers. Gotcha. And, and he's, he's picking up all the chicks he can find. All the chicks within arm reach. He's just like, hey, You're hey, gonna I'm going to pick you up. I'm going to put you in this pen. Girl. I'm going to get you. 
<laughs> I, I don't know if Tommy knows the difference yet between a girl and a girl. What is with the random hay bale just like being suspended by the rope there? Like, like they're in the middle of like bringing it in or out and they haven't decided yet. And it's just there, waiting to be dropped on an unsuspecting victim. And the only victims who are, like, on the set at the time now are just, like, small children. So somebody has strung up a hay bale in order to murder some, some kids there. What game are we playing? Before he comes back. To find those three little piggies, press the circle button to pick one up. And if it's one of the farmer's prize pigs, you'll see stars. Run them over to the pen and press the circle to put them down. You'll have Wait. to find all three before the timer goes off. Ready? So we have to find Light special pigs. Okay. Ha! <laughs> it makes a sad noise. If you get the re the wrong one, it goes. Oh, you suck. Oops. I'm surprised there's only three of them. All these pigs are broken. <laughs> All these pigs need, like, replacement spark plugs. Or a new fuse, or something. It's gonna be this one, isn't it? The- no, 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 put it down. Put him down. It's gonna be this one. There we go. He's, like, the only one left. Oh, I gotta put him down. Oops. <laughs> Great! But you're not done yet! Oh, no. Oh no 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 no! Oh no 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 no! Oh no no! Chase the sheep into the right pens before the time runs out. Oh, we're playing as Spike now. The dog. To make him chase the animals, you have to get all the animals in their right pens before the time runs out. I don't think he's a sheep dog. I think he's like a greyhound or something. I don't know. What breed is your dog? Large. <laughs> he is large breed. Wait, which way am I chasing them? Oh, so there's, wait, there's dark sheep and then there's light sheep. They're not, they're not even like black sheep, it's just like the white sheep have had their, uh, like the lighting turned down on them. It's like they, they had like a fixed lighting source on their models and like that just got turned all the way off. Go, I will chase you into your pan. I will chase you into your pan. Man, they get real quick when they want to turn around like that. Get your ass in that pen there, sheep. And you, sheep, also, your ass in the other pen. Go! I don't know why. This is, uh, really making me want to play some Zelda. <laughs> Just making me think about Lon Lon Ranch. All the, like, rounding up the cuckoos, right? Like, trying to find the, the right one. Doing the races and the and the jumps. Okay, you can do this. You can do this, Spike. Heard the men. Two left. Come on. This is actually like a real simple. Like you get like a good back and forth rhythm going on with this one. As long as you're like conscious of it. And just like trot along. Go sheep, you must be harvested to make a sweater. Where's the last one? There you are. The final shadow sheep. It's just like hopping there, getting 
getting ready for a fight. Don't do this. Don't do it. I'm asking you not to do it. Just go into your pen. Like 30 seconds left. Don't do this. Don't do this. There we go. We want a key! Hooray! That's the end of that. <laughs> fun. Man, these are going real quick, aren't they? Especially if you fail and don't do them. <laughs> Gonna whoop them bad guys when you can't even find your way out of a hallway. That is a good question, my man. Oh, Places hey, we've got golf. Head through yonder doors if you're. And in here we've got. Rootin tootin cowgirl they sent down from casting. Oh, it's a I'm it's like a shoot bang thing. After I'm done with you, you'll be quicker than a roadrunner on roller skates. Yeehaw. Just press left, right, up, and down to aim. Then set the milk ablazing with the X button. With the X button. Okay, shooting gallery. I'm a mean Let's try it out. Machine. I'm probably going to be real bad at this one. Milk I'm squirt scene one. Oh, they're going to make me do it like trail. four times, aren't they? That seems to be the thing. Four scenes and then get the plates and cans before time runs out. Ready? Lights. Get the plates and cans. Oh no! Oh, this one's tough. Oh no! Can you just like? You have to pop like X amount of targets now before time goes. Doesn't look like you run out I of milk. I should have played jump rope instead. Do you want to try again? No. <laughs> no, I don't like that one. <laughs> no, we'll, we'll go try the other one. We'll go try the mini golf. Yeah, this is what I remember. I remember some fucking mini golf in this. Playing golf is easier than falling off a horse. <laughs> to aim, use the left right control. I'm digging this. You can press the square button at the same time to make more accurate turns. Next stop, the hole. Press the triangle button to start the swing meter. Gotcha. Then press it again to hit the ball. The closer Watch the mark out. moves to the left, the further you'll hit the ball. Okay. Ready? Lights, Simple enough, campaign. right? I like that you can, um, you make, like, the curve shot with it. That's, a uh, that's good to know. A cowgirl likes more than playing oh, I get... Susie, away. I have a, like, a distinct memory of this fucking, this golf mini game, and that dipshit narrator, announcer guy, being like, it's the lowest score in golf that wins, not the highest. Alright, par two, swing zero. Okay, so you just line it up. Line it up and... Oh man, I was kind of hoping that would go farther with that. Okay, let's see, tap it. It'd be great if I could see around Susie's fat head. Hey! Oh, too bad the cameras weren't rolling. Oh. Hole one, par two, four, three, four, three, 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 three. okay, cool. Wait, how many holes are there? Nine? Yeah, I think you have to like, get par or under to, to get the key from this. But we, it, that doesn't matter. <laughs> We're just here to have some fun with some golf. I hope the hole hasn't been stolen by bag robbers. Wait, I'm supposed to be...
I'm trying to... I'm trying to get to go on, like, a curve. But that's not happening. Okay, uh... Hmm... I'm gonna say... Like that. In golf, the lowest number of strokes wins, not the highest. That, that, that is burned into my brain from childhood. Let's see, let's fucking hit this thing as hard as we can. Hey, hey. Oh man, am I actually gonna make par on this one? How about that? Come on, you tap it like right there. Did I do that? Yeah, all right, all right, yeah. Yeah, we did it, we played mini golf. <laughs> Hooray. This is like the main reason I wanted to play this game, it's because I remember the mini golf. The mini golf was like the only mini game in this that I actually remember, and um, I don't know. I like it. I think I think it's kind of fun. I'm pretty sure this is like the main reason why I kept renting it as a kid as well. Let's see. Let's see if we can't hit this. Uh, I could have been better, I guess. Where? Okay, that's where my ball is. And that's where the thing is. Okay. What is that key for? Is it like a secret key? Or is it... Oh, I seen what it opened up. Hold on. Yeah, it opened that up. Hold on. Let's drag that... And boom! Yeah, and that is lined up for a good ass shot. shot. And swing! Boom! I won. I won. Yeah, I like this. I like that we're actually making this on par. I haven't been able to get under par yet, but okay when I when I played this as a kid I there's no way I made it I made par just no fucking way end up like shooting the ball so hard it like bounces off the end and comes back up and ugh. All right, so first thing this we want to do... Where they send grown-ups for time out. We'll bank it, like, right there, I think. And... Boom! That shit as hard as you can. So that put us... Where, exactly? What is par for? Oh man, we could make that in, in two. I'll bet if we were if we were good enough, if I hit the right angle, you'd probably hit that in one. Can I back out of that? No, I wanna I can't see. Oh here we go. Here we go, just had to turn it around the right way. Hold on, tap a tap a tap a. And get you tap a tap a tap a. Boom! I did it! Fucking two under. Oh man. I'm way better at video golf than I am at regular golf. I don't think I've ever played like golf golf. I've only ever played like mini putt. Um, way better. 
at Virtual Mini Putt, though. Having the meter, being able to, like, line up and aim and have the meter and everything, like, that's... That's a big help. I'm that asshole that goes to the mini golf course and just, like, fucking hits it as hard as he can. Banking it off shit that you're not supposed to. Uh, let's hit it. Hmm. You know what? We're gonna hit it. There. I'm gonna hit it as hard as I fucking can. Almost. And it can bank off of there. Oh, is there like a like a slope to it? Hmm. Oh. Oh, that's wild. There's almost like a like a hill to it. Can't quite see it though. Yeah, there's like a slight slope to it, but it's like indiscernible. Mini golf! cries Firefox. It couldn't be smaller, this golf. It couldn't be more nano. More minute. Minuscule, even. Hey, hey, hey. Hey. Oh man, look at those, like, skyboxes in the back. The skybox looks way better than the entire rest of the environment. Oh, this hole is hitting. Okay. I don't like it. Let's whack the ball as hard as we can. It's gonna take six shots for us to get through this, huh? Well, I say... I say sure. Six sounds okay. <laughs> that sounds appropriate for this hole. Uh, I'm gonna... Uh, oh man. There we go. Yeah, right there, I think. Yeah! Oh, that was a good hit. Fucking nailed that one. That hole is still down there quite a ways, though. That's better. Uh... So what, am I on swing five now, I guess? I can't. Oh. Oh, that's not great. Oh, but it puts me, like, right in front of the hole, though, so that's not too bad, actually. And I just gotta... Tap it in. Hey, And we still made par. Nah, oh, no. oh, that's not bad. That's alright. Alright, alright. Alright, alright. Oh, man, my DS4 Windows... Bugged out because of the controller. Wonderful. Go so hard around the curves. You got to, man. You got to. On a par six? That's a big course, man. You gotta hit it hard. All those curves, all those hills, you gotta whack that ball to make it get where it's gotta go. Look at that. That one we can take two ways. We go left, we go right. Give me the creepies. Now, which way? Huh, it's gonna take a par of four, huh? Let's see. I should be able, if I hit this just right. Oh, yeah. 
too soft. You didn't eat all your vegetables, did you? I hit, I used like almost all of the force on my meter for that one, you asshole. Don't even give me that. Hey. I meant to do that. I did too mean to do that. That was a good hit. Look at this. We're gonna get like one under par. Because that dynamite hit. Hey, I did it! Uh, this guy says you gotta go light when you're slamming that ball towards a hole around a curve. <laughs> Guys, like you're like I eat all the vegetables. Uh, uh, all of them. I've consumed all of the veggie tables. Let me tell you the tale of veggies. Oh man, here we go. So if you were actually able to hit this with proper force, you'd be able to like use the green as a jump and like ramp it over um it's not gonna do that though you watch instead we have to hit it just like that now i can aim this I want to hit it like that. Just hard enough to send it over the hill and oh! Oh, it sailed just past the hole. Ah, damn. I did it. Ah. No vegetables for you, vegetals. No vegetable, all vegetal. Make sure you eat your fruits and vegetables. Alright, so this one I think has a par of two. But, like, tell me we can't make that in one. Tell me that's not doable in a single goddamn shot. No, let me, let me aim it a little bit there. And brilliant! Oh, too bad the cameras weren't rolling. You are under par for the whole course. That was a hole in goddamn one. Woo! All the vegetals. You have 18 seconds to collect as many reptar bars as you can. Oh, cool! And then the mine shaft will explode with the poor child inside. Leaving her to her fate. Doesn't let you collect a whole lot, especially if you miss them. Damn. Damn, son. I'm feeling lucky. Okay, so we defeated the Lazy Saddles Golf Course. And with that, we've defeated the Lazy Saddles movie set. So we just have the one uh the one set left. Up We're off to out. space. This guy said that was barely any time. Yeah, like that that took like nothing at all. These actually go really quick. Are you sure this is such a good idea? <laughs> Old Rograt's music is so weird. Oh. I ask for Captain Kirk. Look at this guy. Mr. Spook. He's wearing a goddamn astro suit no now. Gone before. Outside space. And I'm going to be sent to the moon if I don't finish this scene. It's not outer space. That's it's outside space. Did. Opposed to inside space. You know the space inside. Hey, you. Yeah, you with a fishbowl on your head. The film crew has been waiting for hours. If you need a quick review of the mission, land on the moon. Otherwise, head to the airlock door. 
That's really cool. He's doing his the voice in the style of like the um was it like the Twilight Zone? Picture a kid. Don't make me be this kid this has set. orange hair really and square freckles. glasses. Freckles on his face and he's kind of a nerd. You're in the spooky door. Uh, I used to jam out to the Maya song, though, back in the day. Are you caught in a time warp? <laughs> Take Hurry me there. And start filming. Zero G's, scene one. What is that? What is zero G's? This is just like a walk in the park. If the park were in outer space. The only difference is you float a little. Press the left or right button to move left or right. Push the up down buttons to move closer or further away. Okay. The X button lets you make space jumps. Picking up booster rockets helps you jump higher. And you oh. never know when you're gonna need your laser blaster. You can activate it by pressing the triangle button. It's oh, cool. Off. Good luck. He just throws lasers at dudes. How am I gonna float when I'm not wearing any floaties? All right, we'll try it out. Space Ranger Chucky. <laughs> Oh. <laughs> His laugh kind of clipped, base. And, and it sounded like a good sample, ship. so. Ready? Light camera! Action! Alright, so, oh, it's just like a 2D, like a side-scrolly thing, okay. I don't know what he's getting hung up on there. Neat, okay. So what, just like make it to the end? Collect as many reptars as you can. Cut. <laughs> let's try that scene again, kid. Yeah, let's try it again. Cut, cut, cut. Nope. Talk about starting at the bottom. Uh, so we gotta wait for that to woo do its thing. Woo. I mean, he jumps pretty decently. Like he jumps way better than they were before. Let's try to I guess it's all again, that kid. space gravity. Or lack thereof. Woo! And woo! Run, Chucky! Oh, man. Let's try that scene again. This is gonna happen on, like, every jump you watch. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, man, it starts me back on this one. Well, fine. It's timed so that, like, you have to wait for it. Do-do-do! Do-do-do! Get the Reptars! Was I supposed to be using the laser thing? I've not been using it. Ah. This one, I think I remember, um playing as a kid as well. This, is, uh, this like, the, uh, like, the treasure level is, um, the treasure hunting one is, is one that, like, was easily doable. Ah, it's invasion of the <laughs> yeah, like, all you gotta do is, like, wander around and collect stuff, right? Huh! Whoa. Booyah. We have, what do we, oh, we got five booster rockets? Ten now. So you use the boost jump instead of the regular jump. Like, you have to be standing still, like, on the ground when you use it. Or I guess you could, yeah, you can move while you're using it, you just can't be in the air. I'm curious, do I have to make it to the end, or do I just have to make it as far as I can? I'm not sure. That platform is taking its sweet fucking time. There we go. Look at that, we got enough Reptar bars to get a free key. So it seems like we can... 
like the guard would have had x amount of keys on his ring right which is presumably are what's scattered around escaped, and what are being used as rewards for yet. these levels Make it to the but the fact that we're able to then the trade moves. in reptar bars Ready? for more Ready? keys than what is actually Ready? like fits in that lock like were there just more keys on his uh on his key ring or like what's the deal there are we just like turning chocolate into keys? Oh, sorry. I got an eyelash in my eye. I can feel it. Oh, I feel it. There we go. At least I think that was it. There may be more. Damn eyes. Oh. Almost, kid. Give Whoops. it another shot. Can you just like boost jump right over that one? Cut. Well, not if you walk off. Let's try that scene again, kid. Not if you walk right into the goddamn pit. My eyes, holy shit! Like actually, for real, holy shit! What is this? Okay, I think that's good. Oh, whoa. Cut, cut, whoa, cut. I didn't know that was going to fall away. Feel the pot. You'd be quick on that one. Cut, cut, cut. There's no such thing as instant success. Oh, man. Okay, don't Cut. Let's try that scene again, kid. Oh, man. That that's a tough jump there. You'd be real careful with cut, your timing, cut, your spacing. Cut. Talk about starting at the bottom. Uh, with the amount that, like, you fail, right? Like, it's it's not necessarily the easiest thing. And, like, it, this is a game for kids. So they had to have known that, like, the kids were going to fail a lot. And that they'd be seeing that scene a lot. Um, cut, cut, cut! Hey, kid, feel the pot. So, like... Why didn't they record more than, like, four lines? Oh. Can't you move the camera, asks Firefox? I cannot. It is stuck. It is stuck in this, um... This angle. To make it more like a, uh... Cut, cut, cut! Hey, kid, make it more like a, uh, like a platformer. Like a 2D platformer. Like a side-scrolly. Like a Mega Man or a or a Mario. Cut, Damn it! Cut, cut. Talk Why do I keep walking off of the front edge like that? That's dumb. I'm not gonna have enough time to finish this one. Oh no! Cut. Take a Oh, oh no! What'll I do if I can't finish this one? Cut, cut, cut. <gasps> You're just gonna jumping no right over success. the platform. Oh, this is brilliant. Oh, he just like fucking stops in the air. Did I hit the do it again button? Oh, I didn't want to do that. Ready? Light. No, we seen it. We seen it. We don't need to finish it. Because I don't... It would probably make us do that like four times total. That's fine. We seen it. Now we can move on from it. <laughs> there should be like, what? Two other games in here? Greetings, Earthling. Take me to your mummy. Ha, I've still got it. But to you, <laughs> if you're ready to be a saucer jockey, blast off through the gateway portal. Otherwise, beam on over to... They sent you to save the whole universe. I hope you're tougher than you look, Red. Head to the airlock doors if you think you've already got the right stuff. Otherwise, stand on the flashing holodeck start button and begin your training. What the Remember, fuck is this? The entire universe is counting on you. Lazy beam no scene? No, I'm trying to walk past it. What is the lazy beam? What is this? Looney Lander. What is the Looney Lander? You'll be ready for takeoff in no time. The X button is your booster run. Press 
press and hold it to go faster. The square button is your um, rocket brake. Press it to slow down or stop. It's your rocket brake. To break. steer, just press left or right. May the horse be with you. No, wait, that's not right. Yeah, that's copyright. I think. Maybe? I don't know. <laughs> I would assume. There's a spaceship at the park. Can All I right. just ride that um, instead? Firefox says, that sounded, um, weird. Take me to your mommy. Hey, man, they know what they want. This, uh... This dude... This, uh... Guy who's running around, meeting us all... At the... At the counters. Showing us, uh, what to do here. You know, he's, he's working hard. Running between all the sets, changing his costume all the damn time. You know, the least he deserves is a chance to hook up with some of the moms that brought the kids in that he's having babysit now. Too slow. Uh, uh. Man, this thing fucking turns. Like, it, it almost, like, drifts on its own. It's so weird. You basically want to, like, use the rocket brake to turn it. Like, to... Like, you want to aim like that? Do-do-do! Okay, I won! Great! You're done! I mean, you're not done, but great! That's all there is to it? You just gotta, like, zoom around into the guys one at a time, huh? What happens if I go underneath the, the ship there? Anything? It doesn't look like anything happened. Wonderful. This is very easy, just like the, uh, like the treasure hunting thing. And, like, the... similar to, like, the, the gold nugget collecting. Only it doesn't suck. Okay. But... I don't know if I like this one as much. Gotcha, There's something weird about it. Some, something weird about, like, oh, just drive around and fucking, like, run down the aliens with your spacecraft. It's like, we're not gonna... We're not gonna try to talk to them. We're not gonna capture them. We're not gonna, like, you know have like a gunfight with them or anything no just hit them with your space car just doing just do an intergalactic hit and run like what what the fuck kind of movie are they filming here all right, all right for this next scene we need you in the hover car and we need you to just run in to them goopy martian motherfuckers and just squish and slide them all over the surface of the moon It gives you way more than enough time to do it, too. Like, you just, like, go real slow at it. Yeah, it's, like, so weird. Like, you go slow, you can get them all and still have plenty of time. And, like, you don't gotta worry about the reptars, because... Well, <laughs> we're already done. I kind of almost want to, like, fail this one. Just to... Oh, hey, there we go. Just so we can get to that last game. <laughs> this will be over quick enough. At least I hope. What is this? Like, what is, what's, what is the set that we're on right now? Am I, like, inside a ship or something? Am, am I riding a spaceship around inside another spaceship? Man, I hate having to reset the camera like that. You're supposed to be able to, like, turn the camera with the triggers, but it doesn't really work in the hallways. It just gets fucking trapped on the walls. 
so you're left to just like turn your character and hit the camera reset button and sometimes it resets behind you like that because there's not enough room or like it resets in front of you because there's not enough room behind you for the camera to rotate all the way great we did it looney lander scene four this is the last one right tell me this is the last one oh man It's like the same scene, isn't it? This is basically the same area. I think it is actually the same area. I'm just doing it as Tommy now. What the hell is this? What, what a fucking waste. You guys can come up with like another level. You, you can come up with like another area design. What the hell is this? It's actually just the exact same level. That's so dumb. Did that one Martian dude disappear? Huh. Oopsie. I'm not sure what those guys like in the saucers are for. But it doesn't seem to matter. Yeah, they keep disappearing every time I go towards them. Are they an objective? Like, do I capture them? Do they... I'm so confused. Oh. There's one dude missing. Is he in here? No. Gotta be back here then. Oh, do they just teleport like on a time? Um, I'm the bestest. Okay. I guess he was like a bonus guy or something. Or li like all the other guys were like bonus dudes. Because there was certainly more than enough of him to cap that off with. Alright, one more minigame to check out, guys. One more. What's it what's it do? How do we play this? This is it. Your chance to save the entire galaxy. Aim with the left, right, up, down buttons. And oh, it's another shooting game. Okay. Talk about being lost It's another space. shooting gallery. This will be done in like however long the timer is. What, like two, three minutes? Tops? Uh, you have one minute and 22 seconds and unlimited zaps to get 36 objects. Oh, that's not gonna happen. Oh, I tell you right now, it's not gonna happen. I mean... No, no. No, 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 no. Why are they all moons and kind of, like, maybe a reptile bar? Also, what's the deal with the pink Reptar bars? Are they like, like I get that they're worth like five regular Reptar bars, but like, are they? S I can't remember if there's like a like a canon like in-universe reason. Like, are they like are they the good Reptar bars that have like nuts or like a like a candy filling or something? Bang, bang. Bang goes the laser gun. Yeah, I missed a whole bunch of stuff. Do you want to try it again? No. No, I do not. <laughs> I just wanted to show it off. Wah, 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 you suck. That's what this music makes me think. Wah, 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 you fucking suck. Wah, 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 loser. 
All right, I will exit to the dressing room and I will go free Dill from the space safe. Space age locked door. All right, look, we have nine extra keys. Way to go. You did it. Are you? Nothing can stop us now. Whoops. Are you fucking Except serious? Tech space age backup security door. You only need one key to open it, though. Too bad I don't remember which lock is the right one. Back to looking for keys. By the time we save Dill, he's gonna be a grown up. Rugrats. Studio tour. Second door. Um. You have nine keys. Which one is it? Which one is it? Um. Second door lock. Hold on, let's see if we can't uh, figure out which one it is here. Items, levels... Nope. Uh... Part 5, unlocking the door. Let's see about this. Sorry, I'm just looking at the uh, at a video for the key puzzle now. Hold on. No, it's not that one. It's not that one. Okay, so the one in the the guy in the video hit this one up top here. I'm gonna. You know what I'm gonna do? Hit that save state. Oh shit! It's gonna be random. Okay. Fine then. Alright, well then let's brute force it. Because we can totally do that. Nope, it's not those ones. So, let's try this then. Da, 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 da. Hey, hey, we figured it out. I guess it's random you guys stay for each here. game. I'm gonna go find help, and then we'll go find a little bald guy. All right, we did it. We got to find Shorty ourselves. But Wait, what do you mean find him? Wasn't he just in like a closet? Angelica's right, huh? There's a first this time for everything. We lost the deal, so it's up to us to find him. Come on, let's go. Wasn't he just like in a closet somewhere? What the fuck? Like, what do you mean, go find him? What is beyond this door? Okay. Come on, you guys. Marge! This is a job for Shirley Lock Holmes. Shirley Lock Holmes, I like that. And then the door locked again. <laughs> and then Angelica locked all of the children. What the hell is this? Is it just like one final whatever? There he goes. The F is happening. How is he able to move in that in that thing? How's he able to like bounce and move himself all the way through? Open the door to my laboratory and find you. Luck, you need it. Because of how many keys do I need? I would assume four? I would guess four is the number of keys. Man, I can't believe... <laughs> I, guess, I guess that's why 
they have you collecting so many keys is because of that uh, that second door. But way to just like throw you for a curve. We just make you think that like oh, the game's only this long, huh? And then nope, nope. Go play like the rest of it. Oh man, what a weird time. A weird fucking game. Who does that? What what game is just like, hey, you're done? No, nah, just kidding. Here's like half a game. Oh, I know a game does that. Fucking Odin Sphere. Ugh. They do it? I found all four keys, I guess. Or does it matter if you find them? What is he doing? How is he operating such a thing? And what is it? What is this? What the fuck is just happening here? I wonder what this button does. Firefox is what they did here is one eighth of a game. <laughs> Pretty much. Don't stand a ghost of a chance. Is that? I think it's Poiseroni down there. Cut. Yeah, I just fell into Poiseroni. Let's try that scene again. A big old puddle of it. All right, what do we have here? Interact with the fucking thing. What was the point of that? I don't know what that did. Did we? Like, where is that? Oh, that's right here. Okay. And that lets me do this. But what is the point of that? What does this button do? Oh! Okay. Two, three. God damn it. Can I hop across that? No, I need to go hit that other switch, don't I? Or... Yeah, I do. Okay. What a puzzle. <laughs> it's like two buttons. I'm surprised that they didn't do, like, more of this for the rest of the game. You know? Like... Like, exploring around the studio, like, solving puzzles, trying to... You know, maybe find uh, keys, like, hidden in, um... Like, the way the rest of the whole game leading up to this shot. plays out, it's almost like that shit heel, like, that, that guy at the desk uh, who keeps changing costumes, it's almost like he picked up all of the keys when, um when the guard dropped them all and he's been making the kids do these games and all this cut, shit cut, cut. Did, fucking hey, forgot kid. there was a gap there the um, making them do all this shit like in handing them out as prizes one at a time uh, for fuck's cut. sakes god damn it Almost, um give it another shot kind of like begs the question like why if that's the case right like why was he holding on to them and not why didn't you just put them back in the lock? It, it makes sense, I guess, like, um... For cut, cut, fuck's cut, sakes, cut. why? Hey, kid. Feel the pot. I don't know why, but, like, I'm trying to go up the stairs, and, the like, it keeps pulling to the right. There we go. Pulled the stick out of the controller there. I don't know if that helps. Now there's a gap there at the top, right? There we go. God damn it. Yeah, it seems like, um... It seems like this would have been more fun. Like, trying to find keys, like, um... Like, hidden away in things, solve puzzles, and there's one in a box or whatever. That does it! I can't work like this! You're on your own, shorty! No, he's not! No, he's, he's right there! Okie dokie Jones. Okie dokie Jones. 
it, like he was right there and she's just like nah my own incompetence let him escape and i just i can't i can't continue to be incompetent and think that i can i can still do something i will just retire whoa you see how quick he moves? Look at that! Look at him zip around! Wow! Cut, cut, cut. Hey kid! Look fucking Sonic up in here! Cut, cut, cut. Oh, There's he is no quick. Such thing as instant success. Oh Take He's too quick. Oh, I lost count a long time it's ago. gonna give me a lot of trouble trying to Cut, cut, cut. Trying to time my jumps. There's no such thing as instant success. Are you sure? Are you sure? Cause like instant noodles are like exactly that. You make the noodles instantly, and like that's a success. Oh cut, shit! Cut, cut. Hey Fuck. kid, feel the part. Feel the part. I mean, feel cut, these cut. nuts. There's no such, no such thing as instant success. <laughs> Temple Run be like, yeah, yeah, that's what it is. I was wondering what this reminded me of. Yeah, it's got some Temple Run vibes. What the hell? Oh. Hurry up. All that waiting, all that timing, and I and I screwed it up. Mm. I'm trying to feel it. I'm trying, but it's it's a bit of a bitch and a half. Wait for it. Wait for that little monkey thing to go, and then. Take a. Oh, I Do I gotta, like, maybe move closer to the camera? Cut, For cut, fuck's cut. sake. Talk about starting at the bottom. Oh, I think maybe we'll come up here and then we'll... Yeah. Because it doesn't look like that actually goes back into the wall all, the, all of the oh, way. Yes, kid. Give it another shot. Yeah, there we go. Okay, we can do this. Come on. Come on, Tommy. Yeah, alright. We we did it. Woo! Are you serious? Let's try that scene again, kid. Oh man. And of course, yeah, and it starts me at the beginning there. Fuck! Talk about starting at the bottom. Alright. All right, so go slow. Walk. Cut, cut, cut. Walk back to hey, the kid. camera. Feel the pot. We're learning the secrets one at a time. Not ugh, just not grasping them quick enough. Almost, kid. Give it another shot. He's oh fuck. He's so quick. Let's he's try that scene again. So kid. quick, man. He's like off the edge before you know it. No, come on. No. There we go. All right, you can do it. You can do it. Wait, line it up and then just run. You just run across. Whew. You gotta be careful though, fuck. And jump! Oh, are you kidding me? Hey, kid, feel the pot. How do you? Oh, thank God, it didn't start me at the beginning. Oh, there's an elevator there. Okay. There's no such thing as instant success. I say that jump is way too big to actually make. There's no way. Out of my way! I got to find my brother. Bam. Cut. Almost, kid. Uh, how do I feel the part, though? Screams Firefox. That's a good question. Oh shit! Cut, cut, cut. <clears throat> feel the part. 
Yeah, it'd be good if he gave us like, it, like tips on how to feel the part. Do we? Hey, hey. Uh oh. Be careful! Don't want to die on that. Okie dokie Jones and the Temple of the Reptar Bar. Come on. Oh, this is not a side area. Okay. I thought maybe. Perhaps some... Oh. <laughs> okay. Ah, uh, oh, hey. I thought I died there for a second. I guess not. I guess this is just the path that I'm on now. Or not. Maybe it's just a bonus spot. That's weird. Can I even get back up there? It doesn't look like I can. Look out! It doesn't look like I can. It looks like I'm stuck. That's fucked up. Where do I go from here? Oh, hold on. Can I... There we go. That's how you do it. Why am I still collecting Reptar bars? Is there going to be another key at the end? Like, is there going to be another lock that I'm going to have to jam a whole bunch of keys into? Whoa. Yeah, this has me thinking that there's going to be, like, another lock... It's going to require even more keys. Oh, man. I, oh, damn. I like those, uh, like, the panels with the... Like, the burst or whatever on them. It's a really good marker for, like, hey, this is where you need to do the thing. This is where you need to jump. Ooh, ooh, god damn. Oh. Talk about starting at the bottom. You gotta be careful with that one. They want you just go go going because of the wood, but then you gotta stop stop stop. Because of that platform. Alright. Woo! He almost cleared that? Are you serious? Cut, cut, cut! Hey, kid! Feel the pot. But there was a platform there. You guys saw it, right? <laughs> cut! Take a... Oh, I lost count a long time ago. What? I don't know what the hell happened there. Oh, wait. Cut, cut, cut! Talk about starting at the bottom. Wait, this is the this is where we start now. This is the next okay. So that was where we were supposed to go. It's just I guess cuz he fell, he would have like broken his little baby cut, legs. Cut. Hey kid, feel the pot. What happened there? We come all the way across, we sprint and then oh. That happened. I see. What's over here now? Why? What the hell? Okay, there we go. I'm just trying to hit left on the D-pad and he's going in other directions. Oh, fuck. I don't know if it's got anything to do with that camera shift or what. Cut, cut, cut! Talk about starting at oh, the bottom. Man. I wonder, do you have to jump over that, or do you, like, jump cut, cut, onto cut. it and, like... There's no such thing as instant success. I feel like that thing is just there to be in your way. Cut. Yeah, it's in there to be to be in your way. Let's try that scene again, kid. Wait for it. Three, two, one, go. Cut, Damn it. Cut, cut. There's no such thing as instant success. Cut. 
It seems like when it gets over to the other side, there, yeah, like there, it's slowed down a little bit. It's, it's trying to trip you up. I don't want to go too fast because I'm worried I'm gonna just like fall off the edge. There you are. There he is. Bye, Tommy. Bye, Tommy. And there you go. Jesus. Final scene, Reptar Park. Hey, look at that. It straight up tells us final scene. <laughs> I finally caught it up to you. There's nowhere to run to, Billy. Nowhere yeah, to Yeah, you're crawl. trapped now, you little on, fucker. Oh, hey, it's the Reptar Wagon. I believe Tommy's dad, Stu, built that. I just gotta make a few more adjustments to this camera platform, then it'll be ready for the big chase scene through Reptar Park. Phew. Aren't you supposed to be the sun any longer, chasing the kids, though? Lizard. Break time. I haven't had one in like 15 minutes anyway. Is he a security guard or is he a maintenance guy? What is his job? It doesn't seem to be all that clear. Oh man! Bye bye, Tommy! Bye bye, Tommy! Oh no! I'll save you, Dill! Again? But this time, I'm gonna get help! I'll pick everybody else up along the way! Pick everybody up in the Reptar wagon. I got one at home. Come on, Angelica, jump in. You got to help me get Dill. I'm on a break. Okay. All right, you get, you stay here and get eaten by the dinosaur. Breaks up. Go. I gotta say, the reptile wagon is super cool. Oh man. Okay, so I hit the wrong direction. I hit forward instead of back. Oh, I lost count a long time ago. And it just gets you right away. Well, doesn't this suck? So, oh man. Okay, so the grass will slow you down. What the fuck? The grass slows you down. The square button is a break. I was just boring. Oh man, and you gotta be real quick about this. If you're not, then he just gets you. Oh man. Fuck. Wow, like, you get no time. Oh, man. Yeah, you have to, you have to do this, like, perfect. If he catches up to you even a little bit, you are screwed. Did we do it? Is that all there is? Hi, Phil. Hi, Lou. Or is this just like oh, a checkpoint? Oh, great. Just what I needed. More babies. Hurry up, get in the wagon. Then you guys quit. We need to go, we need to pick up Chucky and then find Dill. Why is it pointing the other way when it starts? Like we were turn around looking at him for some reason. <laughs> and the dinosaur looks down and he's like, up on closer inspection. These are lawfuls. We're getting hung up on a mushroom. Which I'm pretty sure I was able to just drive through before. That's better. Oh god, I don't like that. Trapped on the dirt here. That sucks. At least they're kind enough to put those like circles in to show you like that it's gonna be time to jump in a second. What the hell is that? 
I thought I did pretty well there, but I guess not. I guess I was the only one that thought so. Stupid video game. Don't get stuck, don't get caught up on shit. Or the dinosaur will get you. What did I get stuck on there? Doesn't matter, because- Oh, he's trapped behind the Jurassic hey, Park Jenny, doors. Hi, Susie. Hi, guys. <laughs> for the ride. We was really oh, I forgot Susie was here. I always forget Susie exists as a character. Because um, <laughs> she was only ever, like, a side character, right? Like, um... Like, Angelica wasn't even as much of a... Like, a main character as, like, Tommy, Phil, Lil, and Chucky. Um... What the hell? What the actual fuck? But like, Susie was like, frequent... Like, she, she was featured like, even less frequently than, uh... Than Angelica was. But I often forget that Susie even existed. I often forget like, all the parents exist as well. And I'm like, oh yeah, yeah, no, somebody had to give birth to these children. Makes sense. That doesn't make a whole lot of sense, I guess. Oh no, the grass, it slows me down. Not the grass! Damn it! You try to swerve to avoid the grass. And then, like, it's like it takes it, uh, it's like it reduces your speed anyways. Oh, here we go. Yeah, use that jump to just pull away from him, I guess. Cool. I didn't know we'd do that. I didn't know. I didn't think we'd just, like, hop over it. Hop away from them. We're doing it! We're beating Raptor! Baby drivers are the worst! Coming soon, final scene. Wait, so does that mean we finished it, or does that mean that there's still more to do? Oh, I think this is it. Everybody out of the wagon. We gotta go hunt down Dill. Alright, trank him on sight. As soon as you get a clear shot, trank the baby and take him down. We don't need him running anymore. And this is our new Reptar Park ride. The scariest, most high-tech ride in the world. If it ever works, it's if it ever still works. got a few bugs in it. Uh, like that. She must be a tester. She, she must be this little girl who came in with you and then wandered off. But, but it was the baby's idea. Now, Angelica, the kids have been here the whole time. Oh my God, they're so oblivious. This tour's probably the kids have been, like, wandering around the studio the entire no, time. it was with me! And we were pirates! Arr, and astronauts! Blast off! And cowboys! yee And we drove racing! And not a single one of them oh, is gonna step up and, and, like, own up overload. to what I'm happened. I'm afraid you can't have any non-dairy ice cream from the studio commissary. It could put you, put you, put you over the edge. <laughs> What? Can no. they? No. I forget. Can the like the babies can talk, and they can communicate like they can communicate amongst each other, and they can communicate with Angelica. But I don't know if they can communicate with their parents. Like they're able to have like like piece together sentences and whatnot, so that we can understand them as the audience. But I don't know if it's like canonical that the parents can. Can understand them. I think maybe they just like 
it's implied that, like, they speak a dumb baby language. Or, like, broken shit English, maybe? I don't know. Um, yeah. Kind of, kind of shitty of them to all just, like, stand there, keep their mouths shut while Angelica gets punished for something that they did. Um... And, like, it wasn't like it was their fault or anything, right? Like, that dumb guard is the one who locked Dill in the, in the fucking thing and lost the keys. Um, the kids are just fixing a grown man's problem. Um, yeah, it's kind of fucked. But here we are at the end of the Rugrats game. That's it. You guys just saw the credits. It's over. It's done. We finished it. 100%. Can't say we didn't. <laughs> You can totally say we didn't 100% this. That's fine. Because cause we didn't. Um, that's fine, though. Uh, I never actually... Yeah, so I definitely played all of those mini games as a kid. Uh, whether or not I finished them and beat them is a whole other issue. Um, I certainly didn't beat them all and uh, and find my way to the end there. I did not play through that final sequence. That was new to me. Um so, <laughs> that was all right, though. I'm glad we got to play through that. Um, I'll probably never play through it ever again. But uh, I'm glad that we got to do it at least once for the stream here. That was cool. It was, uh, it was a nice walk down memory lane. I, uh, I enjoyed the golf. <laughs> I enjoyed the golf, and that was, like, the highlight of the whole thing. So, yeah. Uh, <laughs> woo. So that's that's enough of that then. Um, that's perfect. That uh, that leaves us uh, with an open slot next week since we don't have to finish it, uh, which means that we can jump into our next title, which is going to be the Legacy of Goku Two, uh, which will be the next thing that we're playing on our um, retro weekend, starting on Saturday. Um, There's like a whole new lineup of games this week because uh, we finished off pretty much everything that we've been playing. Uh, save for Yakuza, which we're kind of putting on hiatus for a little bit, just because I'm tired of it for now. Uh, so, uh, I have to update the schedule and post it still. But what we're going to be playing this week is... Are you ready, guys? So, tomorrow, Monday, Tuesday, we're going to be playing Deadly Premonition, which is uh, made by um, Swery. Uh, Swery65, I believe. Uh, the same guy who made uh, D4, Dark Dreams Don't Die, which we previously played on the channel as well. Great, funny, hilarious game. Um, Deadly Premonition is also quirky and goofy and really fun. Uh, and is kind of a um, like an unofficial Twin Peaks game for anybody who's into that. Um, it'll be a really good time. Um, Wednesday, Thursday this week, uh, we're going to be playing Crossing Souls, which we were originally going to play in the Monday, Tuesday slot, but I switched it around um, for reasons. Uh, so crossing souls that'll be fun that'll be cool uh and friday we will be playing uh, i think we're gonna play crash team racing i think we're gonna play some of that just uh just cuz because i want to <laughs> um yeah we'll get through that and that'll be fun um yeah i think and then, of course, Dragon Ball Z on Saturday, Sunday. Um, so, yeah. There's a whole bunch of stuff for you guys to get excited about. A whole bunch of new stuff on the channel to check out. So, it'll be a fun week. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed today's show. At least a little bit. Uh, there was certainly quite a turnout for it. So, that was that was good. Nice to see. Um, hope you guys will be back for more and enjoy the rest of it. Uh, again... Again, shout out and thank you to our mystery ghost subscriber who um, who was kind enough to hit the sub button but uh, did not um, did not use the message prompt that, that they give you. So I do not know who it is to thank you specifically. Um, but if you if you reload your Twitch and you beep bop a boop boop, it'll give me a ding. And then I can dress you properly and thank you. Thank you, Big Matt Preach. Um, 
Car Fox says, I enjoyed it. That's good. That's good. I'm glad you enjoyed it. I'm glad I'm glad at least somebody did. Um Yeah. I'm gonna thank you all for coming today. Thank you, everybody who came to hang out in the Twitch today, live in the chat. And also on the uh, archive in YouTube and on your own time. Thank you. Big Mad Priest to all of you. Wherever you are, find the other platforms and hit your buttons. Uh, hit your um, hit the sub button on the Twitch page and you can find yourself a Discord link behind that button there. It's a cool button. You should check it out. You should check it out. People are doing it now. It's awesome. That's really awesome. That makes me feel like I'm doing something good to see another another thing there. I gotta see, um, there's gotta be some way I can get a hold of that list and, and find out who that was. Because I find it weird that Twitch doesn't just, like, tell you who is subbing to your, your thing. You've gotta work for it, I guess. <laughs> um, weird. It's, like, the only bit of information that they don't just, like, display in your analytics strange but it is what it is um macarena uh <laughs> just trying to think is there anything to say before we go anything to mention i don't know i don't know thank you wonderful ghost subscriber <laughs> you're cool um yeah, I guess I'll just remind you all that this here is the Bone Pit, and I'm your host, Bone Score. I don't make the games, I just play them. Have have a good time doing it. Have a good fun time with it. And, uh, yeah. I'll ask you all to stay inside and stay safe, <clears throat> as I usually do. I'll ask you all to stay hygienic and clean, and I will, I just, I guess, catch you all next time. Have yourselves a good state of existence. Catch you guys later.